fish started showing at uh, dusk last night and uh, they were going absolutely spanners to be fair um, and uh, uh, it was it was incredible to listen to right through the night um, countless countless shows um, couldn't believe I didn't uh, didn't get a pick up um, and uh, eight fifteen this morning out the blue I was in. There you go. I was a bit, uh, a bit off in my uh, my estimate. Thirty pound twelve, just touching thirty one, something like that. So uh, I'm not sure which fish this is, but uh, a really solid chunk of a mirror. Beautiful condition. Mouth's really, really good. Hook hold was sweet, just in the scissors, and uh, yeah, twenty mil, uh, twenty two mil blue oyster. Little, uh, little dairy cream pop up over just just a less than handful of bait really so um, you love it right let's get him back and uh, get to uh, get some breakfast in there I think in one handful of 10 mil house pellet one handful of a mix of small size of pellet one two three four blue oysters and four crumbed baits. That's it, that's all you need to get a bite here. Morning, uh, day four for me, Tuesday morning, and um, had another fish last night, which was uh, which was great, two nights on the trot now. Um, 28 pound mirror, uh, that was from uh, uh, RS Point. Uh, same tactics, very small quantity of bait, Blue Worcester Snowman um, and uh, just a rig in the right position basically. Loads of fish activity last night, um, not actually in front of me, I was uh, expecting I was going to blank actually, but um, loads of fish crashing out um, the other side of the island, so uh, seriously considering a move uh, back over to um, uh, the Point Swims uh, this morning, uh, just yeah, try and keep those fish on the, on the move. Um, and uh, so we don't know which way uh, uh, they're going to be hit from uh, and uh, we'll see, I'm in an hour about that so I've got a fish in the sack to show you uh, let's get him out and uh, have a look at him there we go, 28 pound of a uh, beautiful really solid uh, mirror blue oyster snowman dairy cream pop up again very very small trap of bait and this one was off a uh, off a point called a uh, iris point. Uh, it's just a few irises sticking out there. About uh, about six seven foot in front of it, in about three four foot of water on a little uh, a nice little gravel uh, gravel slope really. So um, smashing result went off at five a.m. this morning. And uh, yeah, top job.
high for me Wednesday morning and um, uh, moved yesterday uh, as I as I mentioned that I was considering doing um, look looked to be that it was definitely the right thing to do so uh, I moved into uh, uh, into point A I've got two rods out of point A uh, one out of point B and one out of point C um, and um, I didn't actually start fishing uh, until 3 p.m. something like that and uh, basically just waited um, for the first show first show first rod went out everything was set ready to go bank sticks were already in fresh baits were on hooks were sharp all ready to rock and roll fish sticks his nose out two minutes I've dropped the bait on its head uh, I then repeated that um, four times um, uh, one rod um, I actually decided to um, uh, put out where I was uh, intending to put it um, which was uh, out of point B um, and there's a, uh, there's a little marginal rock feature underneath the water uh, just to the right of a fir tree um, and uh, I, you know, it's a classic uh, it's a classic spot um, I, I think that um, uh, it does get fish but it probably doesn't get fished accurately enough um, uh, you've got to be absolutely spot on with it you've got to know exactly where it is um, and um, again same tactics same presentation blue oyster uh, dairy cream pop up snowman little handful of bait um, and uh, it was the roll out point B that, um, that rattled off at 2am uh, this morning right here you go this is Dink and uh, a little bit likely after a, after a kip in the sack uh, 32 and a half pound blue oyster snowman off a little handful of bait in front of a, uh, in front of a rock a nice little gravel run in front of it and uh, yeah, well happy with that one. Makes the effort of the move worth it. And uh, really, really solid lump of a mirror. Stunning.